Hello everyone, my name is Cullen, and today we're building a 3D printable outsole in Gravity Sketch. There are two current standardized ways of additively manufacturing footwear, SLS or selective laser sintering, and FDM or fused deposition modeling. We will focus on FDM printing standards to set up our model today. A common first step within Gravity is to sketch first, to not only get a general direction for the form, but also address the key initial thicknesses within the outsole and the walls that will be crucial at the exporting phase later on. Working on quick sub-D surface visualizations helps further give the shape life while also moderating its printability along the way. Then, using sub-D and starting from a cube, a footplate is molded around the shoe last using a simple extrusion gesture to generate simple and printable tread patterns, as you see here. Maintaining pivotal thicknesses within the outsole is key, and a helpful trick at this stage that I like to use is the Select Loops tool. So once your edges are all equilateral, then simply grabbing the edge and extruding upward to begin to form a midsole or upper can occur, and at a constant thickness too which is hugely important for printing. Quick upper visualizations help tie in the outsole design to what would be a hypothetical printed upper. And this is now easier than ever using Gravity Sketch's new thicken surfaces feature. Once the design is finished, Thicknesses should be double checked and overhang should be kept somewhat feasible. Also for the best exporting practices, your model should be moved to the center of the world axis. It's also helpful to simulate your build plate size and have your model scaled accordingly. Orientation for one-piece prints is slightly different due to the upper providing most support material otherwise needed. But standard orientation still works best with most outsole prints. Simply place the model on its own export layer and make sure other layers are turned off. Then connect yourself to the cloud and export as an OBJ with your desired units. Once you're in your slicing program, your design should be scaled and oriented as you planned in Gravity Sketch. I have a general flex filament selected for my NinjaFlex Cheetah TPU, and with layer heights at 0.1 to 0.15 millimeters, you should achieve high fidelity details and smooth surface finishing. Increasing nozzle temperatures to around 240 to 270 degrees Celsius is also highly recommended. Thank you so much for watching, and make sure to check out the Gravity Sketch YouTube channel for plenty of other helpful footwear and design tutorials, as well as following me on Instagram at S-E-E underscore K-A-Y.